In this video, we see the difference between male and female Swiss albino mice. The Swiss albino mice are the most commonly used experimental animals in biomedical research. The males are more commonly used as compared to the females because the estrous cycle in the females can influence the experimental results. Another important reason is that it helps us to separate the male and female mice after 4 weeks of age to avoid overbreeding. Here is a male mouse, otherwise called the buck. Gently lift the mouse by holding the scruff. The scrotum is clearly visible. However, in case of retracted testicles, the scrotum is shrunken and is not visible. Hence, it's not a reliable marker for differentiating a male mouse from a female mouse. Now, we are measuring the anal genital distance, that is, the distance between the anal orifice and the tip of the genital papilla. It is around 2 cm. This is a female mouse, also called the doe. The nipples are clearly visible. The nipples are usually obscured by fur, except in the case of pregnant and lactating female mice. This is a lactating female mouse and hence the nipples are clearly visible. Now let us measure the anal genital distance of the female mouse. If compared to that of the male mouse, the anal genital distance is less, around 1 cm. Clearly appreciate the relative difference in the anal genital distance between the male and the female mouse. The distance is almost double in the male mouse as compared to that of the female mouse. This is a mice pup, otherwise called the pinky. It's around 2 days old and measures about an inch. Thank you for watching. Leave your comments and suggestions below.